After this, Gabriel took me to the fourth place. This is the place for people who have committed adultery. If you have committed adultery, you must repent and ask for forgiveness from Jesus. Ask Jesus to wash away your sins and sin no more. The angel Gabriel told me that those people were adulterers. When they die, their soul ends up in hell. In just a short moment, I saw the demons. The demons took what looked like red crayfish on earth, like the ones you would see at the restaurant. But these were not crayfish at all. The demons took these red creatures and used them to bite these people's bodies. And the creatures bit their whole body. The demons also took long snakes, and these snakes would wrap around the bodies of the people there, and the snakes would squeeze them really hard. Now these appear to look like snakes, but they were not snakes. They are actually fire. So when the snakes wrapped around the bodies of these people, they would burn them. And I tell you this, that while the snakes wrapped themselves around these people there, there were snakes wrapped around me too. God had allowed this to happen to me, so I can come back and tell you how hot it is. The pain I felt was burning pain. The snake squeezed me so tight, and I felt terrible pain. When that happened, we all wept with gnashing of teeth. Not one person there can help the other. Not one person there can reach out their hand to help the other person. We were all on fire. It was extremely painful. We were thirsty for water. The pain was all over our bodies. At that time, I felt like I was going to die. I felt like I was dying. It was excruciating pain. If any one of you have committed adultery and you don't repent while you're still alive, when you die, you will go to hell. I tell you that the pain you will experience is real pain and it is burning pain. You will thirst for water, you will feel like you're going to die, and that you are dying but you cannot die. There is no rest in hell. It's like when you're still alive and you're gasping for breath because you cannot breathe. In hell, it is like that. I want you to know that I have been there. I have been to hell. I've been tested in hell. It is excruciating pain. It is burning pain. It's kind of like when you're still alive and you take your hand and put it in fire. But it is worse than that in hell. It is hotter. It is terrible. You feel like you're going to die and there is no rest. Not even for a minute. You feel like you're dying and your life is as thin as a thread. You can feel the pain right in your heart. It's bitter pain, excruciating pain. Nothing compares to this pain.